Hi everyone, I am going to focus today on being able to receive a Word document to your iPad and then convert it into a Pages file in order for you to edit it. Um, in my case, I have received a letter template and so I'm going to sign it within Pages and then I'm going to export it back out as a PDF. First of all, here is the Word document that I have been sent. So I'm going to open that up and then I'm going to look for this button in the top right hand side, as you can see there, I'm going to click on that button and then I'm given some options as to what I then do with the letter. So I'm going to scroll along until I see those three dots there. I'm going to press on those and then I'm going to find um, copy to pages and it will open that file up within pages. Now that I'm in pages and the document is fully uploaded there, I'm going to click on the plus sign in the top right hand corner there and that plus sign gives me certain options and one of them is drawing. So I'm going to click on drawing and that will allow me to create a signature block. Now, it's quite large, the signature block now. I click on the side of the button and make it smaller. Now, it won't at this point be in the correct part of the letter. That doesn't really matter while I sign it. I can move it afterwards. So now that I've made it fairly nice and small about the size that I want the signature to be, I'm going to select one of the drawing tools there. I'm just going to um, select the pen and then I can go to this side and change the colour. So I'm going to change the colour to black. And now that I've done that, I'm going to zoom in by pushing apart the document there. So now I'm just going to sign my signature within that little box, just using my finger. Done. Now that I have managed to add my signature, I'm going to move the box to a more appropriate part of the letter. So I'm just going to drag it down with my finger to um, where you would expect me to sign. I'm going to make it a little bit smaller, make sure that it's all aligned. And then, like I did previously in a previous video, I'm going to export it by pressing three dots in the corner there and then I'm going to export the file and I'll be able to do that as a PDF document. And then I can share it whichever way is most appropriate. In this case, I'm going to email it over to my colleague.